Hi, I'm Bud Bacone in the Doghouse AKC headquarters here on Madison Avenue in New York City. I'm standing in front of one of the real high points of the AKC art collection. It always stops traffic whenever people come by here. The picture is called Alexander and Diogenes, and it's from the studio of Sir Edwin Landseer, said to be Queen Victoria's favorite painter. The story behind the picture doesn't begin in Victoria's British Empire. Instead, we have to go back to the fourth century BC to the Macedonian Empire built by Alexander the Great. It is said that Alexander was leaving on one of his great military campaigns from the city of Corinth. The entire population of the city came out to wish him well. Everybody, that is, except for Diogenes. Diogenes was a philosopher who shewed all worldly goods. He lived in an overturned wine tub. He had no possessions. Alexander looked through the crowd, knowing that this was the town of Diogenes, the very famous philosopher, and he said, where is Diogenes? And they said, well, he didn't bother showing up. So Alexander walked across town and he confronted Diogenes and said to him, I am Alexander the Great, the most powerful man in the world. What can I do for you? Diogenes looked up from his reading and he said, well, you can get out of my light. You're blocking my sun. And the whole crowd laughed at that. And he was kind of embarrassed, but he turned to his friends and he said, yes, but if I were not Alexander, I would be Diogenes. Old fashioned way of saying, this guy's got some guts. This story has been told many, many times in many, many ways, but not the way Lancier painted it. Let's take a look at the painting. We see Alexander here, the big proud white dog with the military collar around his neck. We see his court who has followed behind, the beautiful little dog with the ribbon in her hair symbolizing the ladies of the court, the two big hounds in the back, probably Alexander's bodyguard. And here we see Diogenes in his overturned wine tub with the lantern here that always symbolizes Diogenes. The picture really is a bit of a joke because the whole thing is based on the word cynic. Diogenes was the head of the cynic school of philosophy. Cynic comes from the word kainos, which means dog in Greek. His neighbors started calling him the dog because he lived like a dog in the street. He thought dogs were noble and lived life the right way. They had no possessions, they had no pride. His school of philosophy therefore became known as cynicism or the cynic school. This is Landseer having a nice laugh about art and ancient culture and Victorian culture. This kind of painting was very popular in Victorian times, using animals to play out famous human themes. It has rarely been done with as much wit and style as this painting. I should also tell you before we wrap up, Diogenes didn't mind being called the dog because he thought dogs were the most noble of all creatures. He liked to say, I fawn over those who give me something, I bark at those who don't, and I sink my teeth in the ankles of rascals. This is Bud Bacone in the Doghouse. I'll see you next time.